So this is our uh, 17 Hilux tow vehicle. I'm gonna have a look at the 12 volt setup on this that uh, TJM put together for me. So we've got a um, solar panel on the roof mounted to the Rhino rack rail. So it's neat and tidy with the rest of the Rhino racks and the boat can slip over that roller quite easily. It's actually booked in to have um, drawer systems and stuff fitted in a little kitchen that goes in here that I saw at the show the other day. But um, it has a um, projector charger, which is no big deal, but it's cost effective. And I've got two of them, so I can put in 50 amps. And uh, I've got a uh, 2500, um, 2500 inverter here. It's just a power tech. Again, nice and cost effective. And TGM at Spinifex make these for me. Over here, we've got the um, air blower and um, lights, accessories, multiple chargers, all kinds of chargers, USBs. Um, and then, um, obviously, uh, cigarette socket outlets as well. And uh, it actually doesn't take up any room whatsoever except for the wheel arches. These boxes tight, hug in tight to the wheel arches and just go through to the back. That's a um, CFX95, so that's, that's their largest fridge. And um, there's still room for a standard drawer in here, which is exactly what's going to happen. And then under here is where the airline is kept. Um, I'll plug in the I'll plug in the power. I'll show you what this thing can do. So full full charge, which is all the time, unless you run your airplane all night. At full charge, this thing will run. I'm just going to make sure the two sets of batteries are linked to each other. I've got um, two lots of 150 amp batteries in there and two lots of 150 amp batteries under there. So I've got uh, 600 amps and that'll run my caravan all night at uh, 20 degrees. So there. Let's just follow that lead. All right, let's follow that lead. And there we go, 16 degrees. Let's just watch this bad boy fire up. That's pumping out freezing cold aircon. Yep. So if you're at a um, caravan park or whatever, or you're just within 50 meters of another camper that doesn't want to hear your gen set going, then um, yeah, just run your AC off a inverter set up like this and um, I'm sure there's different companies that could do it for you you know you'd probably be anywhere up to 10 grand for a setup like that or more if you went lithiums and better brand names and projector or power tech but um, I supplied some of these parts to TJM and told them what I wanted and I got this whole thing done for about uh, well, was well under three grand that's um, not much more than a generator only. There's not, not any noise coming from here. It doesn't use any fuel. It's powered by the sun. 
than by the car as it's driving along anyway. And um, yeah, it just used up the room that would usually be a set of wheel arches. So as far as caravan setups go for running caravan ACs, I reckon that's a pretty good setup. I run it all night. I haven't actually run it flat. Um, if I run it at 16 degrees, I get about five hours out of it and it will run flat, but at 20 degrees going to sleep, it's never let me down. So yeah, all good. That's our, um, that's our Hilux and our 12 volt setup.